George Dilboy came to America from Asia Minor as a child and eventually settled with his family in Somerville. At the age of 17, he returned to Greece to fight in the Balkan Wars against the Turks. He enlisted in the New Hampshire National Guard in 1916 and traveled to Mexico to fight in the Pancho Villa incident. When World War I broke out, he again enlisted in the U.S. Army. Private First Class Dilboy died on July 19, 1918 in action near Belleau, France, and posthumously received the Congressional Medal of Honor, making him the first Greek-American ever to earn it. Designed by artist Raymond Porter, this monument actually honors Somerville residents who fought in three separate conflicts. Consisting of a granite base with an eagle on top, a statue of a soldier on the left side and a sailor on the right, it bears a tablet that reads, in honor of the volunteers from Somerville who served on land and sea in the war with Spain, the Philippine insurrection, and the China Relief Expedition, 1898 to 1902. Comprised of two overlapping granite pyramids that form the letter V when viewed from any angle, this memorial bears the name, unit, place, and date of death of personnel killed in action during the Vietnam War. Residents of Somerville are displayed on one side with those from Cambridge on the other. The end of one pyramid is etched with a 1957 Vietnam map, while a 1972 Vietnam map appears on the opposite end. Each side of the monument bears the legend, We Can't Forget. Originally placed in Union Square, it was moved to the present location in 2007. Designed by architect Augustus Lukeman, this statue of a Union soldier, followed into battle by an angel carrying an American flag, honors all military personnel who fought in the Civil War. A copper box containing items of the day was buried beneath the statue during the laying of the cornerstone. <laughs> 